You're listening to The Coffee Hour. I'm Andy Bates. Sarah's away today. It is National Lutheran Schools Week. We are celebrating National Lutheran Schools Week with schools who have visited the International Center as well as around the country. So today we head to Texas. We'll talk with our friends at Faith Lutheran School in Plano, Texas in just a moment. Thanks to Concordia University, Wisconsin for supporting the Coffee Hour. Find out more about Concordia University, Wisconsin at cuw.edu. Joining me today are students and faculty from Faith Lutheran School in Plano, Texas. First up, we have Elizabeth. Elizabeth, welcome to the Coffee Hour. Hello. Elizabeth, uh, why did your family choose Faith Lutheran School for your education? I believe my family chose Faith Lutheran School for my education because they wanted me to prosper in a Lutheran environment, and they also really wanted me to receive the best possible education that I could. They knew that Faith Lutheran School's mission was is to present everyone complete in Christ, and they wished for me to learn how to be a hardworking, faithful Christian so that when I go out into the secular world, I would be well prepared both in the workforce and also in other godly things. Very good. And uh, we also have joining us today, Julia. Julia, welcome to the coffee hour. Hi. Share with us why your family uh, share with us why your family chose Faith Lutheran School for your education. They mainly chose faith for the classical education that it offers and the rigorous curriculum, and also the fact that it's deeply rooted in Christian teaching and values. It's also a school that still puts an emphasis on non-academic as well as academic improvement. Students learn about manners and helping others and serving their communities alongside what they are taught in their subjects and their classes. Very good. And I, I, uh, Julia, what grade are you in this year? Ninth grade. Ninth grade. And I forgot to mention, Elizabeth is in 10th grade, I believe. Is that right, Elizabeth? Yes, I'm a sophomore. All right. Very good. And now joining us is Lance. Lance, welcome to the coffee hour. Hi, thank you. And Lance, what grade are you in this year? I'm a senior this year. Congratulations. So you can probably see the light at the end of the tunnel a little bit. Probably pretty excited about graduation. Uh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> so Lance, why did your family choose Faith Lutheran School for your education? Well, my uh, parents were born and raised Lutheran in Tanzania, and my mom's side is very uh, committed to the Lutheran church, and my dad also as well with a mix of Anglican in there. So whenever they immigrated here to the U.S., to Oklahoma, I was in a, a Lutheran preschool, Messiah Lutheran Church in Oklahoma mm -hmm. City, and whenever my dad's job was moved to the Dallas area, we're looking for another Lutheran school. And we came across Faith Lutheran here in Plano, so that's why we moved to Plano as well. Very good. So, Lance, share with me, when do you learn about Jesus throughout your day or throughout your time? You, you've been, it sounds like you've been there for a little while at Faith Lutheran School. When do you get to learn about Jesus? So, being um, a classical Lutheran school, um, Jesus is the center the center of everything, of our teaching, of our life, how we live, to be more Christ-like, and being a uh, faith Lutheran, being a uh, faith Lutheran school, being a part of the church. We attend, we have chapel regularly every week, every Wednesday, and we have, the school has morning devotions, the high school as well has morning devotions, and so we hear, we hear Christ's word um, very often. And we learn more about him through our classes as well. In the high school, we learn in our omnibus class, that is our English slash literature class. We read a lot of books. We, really, really, we read a lot of ancient slash classical books that are, may not even be Christian, but yet we look at them through a Christian worldview perspective and how, what can we take away from that and to live by that through being, being more Christ-like. Elizabeth, when do you get to learn about Jesus at your school? I get to learn about Jesus all day, every day. Mm -hmm. We have daily worship, and then on Wednesdays we have chapel, which the whole school gathers together to listen to Bible readings, sing hymns, and listen to one of our pastors preach. And 
also even in the academic world, we I get to see how God's handiwork is visible in math and science. I learned the history of some of the early church fathers in Omnibus, like Lance mentioned. And especially in theology, we delve deeper and deeper into the hidden meanings of the Gospels and the prophets and how their messages are still relevant today. Thanks. Julia, anything you'd like to add to that about when you learn about Jesus at Faith Lutheran School? I think they said all that pretty well. We do have a lot of religion and theology classes. Every grade from oldest to youngest has something like that. And we do have opening devotions and chapel services. But the good news of Christ's coming isn't restricted to only these times because in all of the many and various classes students take, they're constantly reminded of the fact that they're saved by faith and grace alone. So, Julia, this is your first year in high school, is that right? Yes. So, what did you, what do you think you'll gain throughout your time at Faith Lutheran School that you'll you'll bring with you to the next chapter in life after high school? Definitely, the information and understanding we get in middle school literature classes and then the high school on this course too, because we read a wide variety of written works from like really ancient times to more modern. And some of these books are from Christian perspectives, but others show entirely different worldviews. But these are just as important because at the same time, as students are reading secular writings, they're discussing them with teachers from a Lutheran point of view. Elizabeth, how about you? Being in 10th grade, what's one thing about your education at Faith Lutheran School that you think you, you will value greatly and bring with you into your next chapter in life? There's certainly more than one thing. I believe that since I've always been taught to always work hard and persevere, I'll keep this in mind as I apply for colleges and go out into the workforce. I've also been taught to always be kind to one's neighbor and to respect and help those in need. We get to interact with the younger students at our school and sit with them in chapel, do read with them, interact with them. And I will take that into consideration when I'm out in the real world. But most importantly, the one thing I'll value the most is that I have learned that I am saved by grace through faith. And even though I am a poor, miserable sinner, Jesus died on the cross to save me from my sins. Thanks. Lance, a a little bit closer than uh, our other students today to graduation and that next chapter in life. Uh, What do you think you will value greatly as you move into that next chapter? Yes, certainly. So throughout my time here at the high school, from my freshman year, actually, my faith in Christ has greatly matured. I've been surrounded by our pastors here, men of God, that have really greatly inspired me. And I've been considering the ministry through the past few years. And as my next chapter is right at the doorstep, <laughs> it's, I mean, it's a lot to think about, but the, the support and the support and love that I have here has given me the confidence to, to say that's the plan, that I'm, I, I really want to go to the seminary and to be a servant of Christ. And honestly, no other school would have done that would have not would have not impacted me in this way no public school would that doesn't even teach uh theology or the truth but yet that's what makes this privilege that god has given me even just so much more greater and i'm very thankful and without i mean yes we i would have uh, learned more about christ and his love through the church and my home but the impact that Faith Lutheran High School has given to me in my life has greatly matured my faith, and I would have not considered seminary if it weren't for faith. Now joining us, Mrs. Christy Rivers, a teacher of grades three and four, and also a parent of students at Faith Lutheran School in Plano, Texas. Mrs. Rivers, thanks for joining us on the Coffee Hour today. Thank you for having me. So what makes Faith Lutheran School in Plano, Texas unique? Well, as the students touched on, everything we do here is informed by a Lutheran worldview. Faith Lutheran School is absolutely, unapologetically, confessionally Lutheran. We 
from the curriculum we choose to the way that we choose to celebrate, the things that we celebrate, the way we deal with conflict, everything we do goes through that lens. You know, we teach truth here and that's something that the world seems to be lacking. And as you can hear, these kids are very discerning. They're very mature in their faith and they, they know what is good and beautiful and true. So how does Faith Lutheran School then prepare students for their next chapter in life? How, how well equipped and prepared are they for that next chapter? I think they're incredibly well prepared. Yeah. They, they're preparing to live as citizens in the world that is hostile to their... I actually came to Faith, you know, for the first time as a prospective parent. And the thing that really struck me was the way that these kids can sing. I came to chapel, and it's not just that they're very talented singers, it's that... They really value the, the liturgy and the hymnody of our church. And so these kids are prepared, knowing the history and the, of our church and the, the theology of our church and why we do what we do. They're, they're prepared to be future pastors, teachers, musicians, lay people. And, and so not just preparing them for college, but preparing them for a life in the church. <laughs> Mrs. Rivers, how can we learn more about Faith Lutheran School in Plano, Texas? Uh, You can go to our website at flsplano.org. You can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook for more information. Very good. Very good. Well, I want to thank everyone, all of our guests today, Elizabeth, Julia, and Lance. Uh, Thanks so much for joining us as scholar students from Faith Lutheran School in Plano. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thanks for asking us. Thank you for having us. Mm -hmm. And Mrs. Christy Rivers, a teacher of grades three and four, a parent of students at Faith Lutheran School. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. You've been listening to The Coffee Hour. I'm Andy Bates. 